My name is Priscilla and I am a humanitarian worker. My first mission was in Iraq. I arrived in the summer of 2014. It was just after the elections had taken place. As we reached the camp, we were met with a protest at the entrance checkpoint. The residents were desperate. Where do I get water when there is no fuel to pump the water? Please, mother, I want water. We haven't had any fuel for weeks. Our containers are burning hot and there is no cooling system. My child drank dirty water and now he's really sick. My team and I decided to talk with the camp authorities to understand what was happening. We can't risk fuel tankers coming in. They may be carrying explosives. At the negotiation workshop I attended, we talked about the iceberg. It is a method that helps analyze the real reason and motives behind someone's actions. I know the real reason tankers are not allowed in the camp. The authorities think residents are hiding their fuel reserves. But we can show them this is not true. We told them that we had searched but couldn't find any secret reserves in the camp. We asked if they would allow just one tanker to enter with our escort. It seemed we had touched upon the real issue behind their hesitation. We successfully negotiated for the fuel tanker to enter the camp. This brought relief to the residents. Over the years, I learned that being a good negotiator can make a huge difference in the lives of many. And now I'm off to the next negotiation.